Okay, we're recording. Yes, we are. Hello, everyone. I have a lot of stuff to do today. <laughs> and uh, all of that has to do with my uh, amazing ability to procrastinate. So, uh, yeah, there we go. I'm gonna get started with some expert. We got a nice insta queue there. Also, it looks like we're getting the uh, adventure in need bonus, which I think is just some extra gill, but you can't complain about some extra gill, right? You can always use more gill. Oh, good. We got the, the new one. I'm so happy. I'm like so tired of freaking Arboretum and <laughs> the uh, amazing music. I'm so tired of making fun of how bad the music is. I got double barred as well, that's interesting. I'm just gonna let this hit me and see how much it does. Not that much. And look at this convalescence. Like, like I'm actually gonna be healing you. Also, I totally forgot to put Aos on Obey. I think I need to change um, how I target, like uh, my target settings, they're messed up. Like I think they've been messed up since I switched over to PC forever ago, but um, I just never noticed because I've never actually been in a situation where it's bothered me this much, but in this particular dungeon where there's a bunch of um, friendly NPCs, uh, my targeting definitely is noticeable. So I like how we have double bars and I didn't get a single refresh. I mean... Also, did anyone sing foes? Like, come on. Man, these guys don't even bother putting up the straight shot. Did I just miss the memo about straight shot? Is it just not worth using straight shot in AoE situations? I wouldn't put it past... I wouldn't put it past that to be a thing, honestly. Scholars doing the most AOE DPS. You know, you guys can you can put up Tactician at least. You don't need Tactician to, to refill your MP for foes. And Paladin looks like you could use it. Nah, man, just go. I'm fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Hey, foes, look at that. I'm so happy for you guys. Still missing a... Still missing a straight shot there. But at least we got the foes. Imagine if, like, healers 
forgot things as much as like DPS did. Like, it's like, oh yeah, I totally forgot to use um, physic. <laughs> like, okay. See, but that that wouldn't really uh, that wouldn't really work out, now would it? And it's really an event followed like, followed by this crap. <laughs> like really? Followed by that? What is wrong with this? And I'm just trying to to save my GCDs. And and you, you keep throwing this crap at me. That's <laughs> Yeah, he'll be fine. He's got X card. Got oh, two Cerulean vents. I just, I don't know why, but like, I've just realized how stupid this boss is with the freaking, with with all of the uh, the freaking AOE damage that goes out. Also, rip my MP because of Whispering Dawn. Like, I didn't even cast Whispering Dawn. Like, that should all be Aos. Aos, that's your fault. I could really use a refresh right now. Oh man, I can see how much... Yo. <laughs> I can see my my fairies embraces now. That is so good. Like like they made that change where you could see like how much how much your your eggy is doing, how much your turret is doing. I was playing Astrologian the other day and I could see how much my earthly star was doing. And you've always been able to see that, but it's always been like the dot numbers, so it's it's pretty much impossible to notice because it blends in with all the other numbers. But this they they distinguish it so that it's it's obviously your numbers, so I, I really like that. Oh. That's all I can do because I don't have any MP left. The top DPS is taking taking a seat, getting benched. I almost have Aether Flow and Lucid back up.
Oh, I did not know he did oil shower in this first phase. Usually he just he just goes and goes underground by now. So can I just? I'm just gonna freaking do this. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. Dissipation. I don't. I don't need it. I don't need the fairy. Damn, that Indom. It's good to know that Whispering Dawn triggers Divine Veil. <laughs> I did not know that. Imagine if Aeos just, just completely died from that. That'd be kind of funny, actually. Annoying, but funny. It's very inconsistent, the things that your pets actually do take damage from. And being able to see Embrace is so, so nice. That's like low key one of the best quality of life changes <laughs> that, that came with the patch. Well, at least we can we can freaking cast Swift Song. There's just uh, any other songs. That was really bad timing. It's come to my attention. This is probably the last uh, rendition that we're gonna get for all these Stormblood themes. This this song. Alliance Festival. Oh, come on, man. He's in front of me. Or she's in front of me. I <laughs> Why does it do that so often? Whatever. Freaking Mecha Grill over here.
Eh, screw it, I'll use my Lucy. Man, I almost went Astrologian, which would have been a waste. <laughs> I definitely need the extra the extra MP capabilities of uh of, of Scholar right now. <laughs> And who wouldn't take a free crit buff? Especially on a job that relies on crits so often. Or so much. Now one thing I've noticed about um, the NPC who does their like limit break attack is that it's always random who does it. Like I've seen Hien do it, I've seen um, I've seen Yugiri do it. I've seen Lee do it. The Delta Trance does like so much damage. <laughs> you remember in Arboretum when was it Lock Hamu, the second boss? She she does like Stone Two and it does like no damage. Yeah, that's not what Delta Trance does. Delta Trance does all the damage. What was that bar doing? <laughs> I don't even. Why? It's always funny when bars get hit with AoEs, because it's like, it feels like there shouldn't be any reason for it to actually be a thing, considering how much mobility they have. Also, focus targeting probably would, would help a little bit. in the middle. Oh my god! Look at that! Refresh. It's like the one time I didn't need it. <laughs> it's when I get it. Damage. You're fine, dude. You don't need a clemency. <laughs> Please don't get blown up. Like, I know you want to, but just don't. <laughs> what did I say? Gonna raise at a worse time.
No, I changed my mind. Delta Trance doesn't even do that much. I think freaking Fine Whip does more damage than Delta Trance. Or maybe it's just about the same damage. We didn't miss the limit break. <laughs> Those were a couple of interesting bars there. Look at that one. Look at that nine. Also, I greeted it for some reason. 63. Interesting. Hey, I got the orchestral roll for my troubles. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, that really got me in the mood to play some more. <laughs> That's really, really getting into it now. Look, Alliance Raids needs healers. <laughs> I want to do that. If I get uh, Royal City or uh, or um, Ritorana, then it it helps get free coins. I guess I'll give it a shot. I actually haven't touched um. Monastery yet on this character. I didn't even grab my bills. What am I doing? <laughs> oh man, my entire flow has been thrown off. So like earlier I ordered like this big bag of mints and it's uh off of like Amazon <laughs> and it was only like 10 bucks and they're like I really like them they're like key lime mints and uh the one one of the the buffets I go to every now and then on occasion has has like a basket of them so I always grab a handful I really like them so I decided to order like a big pack of them it was a really big pack <laughs> like it was only 10 bucks, and it looks smaller in the picture, but when I actually opened it this morning, I was like, holy crap, that's a lot of mints. So now I just have this big tin of mints. There's just a ton of mints inside. This big jar of mints. And then I have like, that's only like half of them. The, the rest of them are just in a bag, just on my shelf. All the mints. But it's nice, cause like, it's a nice little, little snack, candy, something for you to, to uh, to stave off hunger while you're uh, doing things at the desk. Fairly painless to unwrap. I'm trying to sell mints on this channel for something. You you think I'm being sponsored by Key Lime Mints or something? But uh, no. No, I'm not. Alright, let's just... Please don't be boring. That's that's all I can ask for. I haven't actually done Dunescape or World of Darkness in a long time. I've done I've done the rest of them fairly recently. Oh, we got the f we got the super fun one. This is like probably the easiest one out of all nine so far. I remember I remember how 
how easy this was even on launch. Well, I say that, but then I remember all the times when people didn't stand in the meteors. When, <laughs> when, when we still did the stupid ring around the rosy thing on on Glab Glabia Glabiolus. What I don't I don't know his name. Whatever the second boss's name is. I remember we used to have problems there too. Also, I forgot to get a new Wondrous Tales. So I don't like the rewards on this one, so it's like... Eh. Honestly, I'm not even sure if I even have to heal. I mean, everything dies so fast anyway. Oh, another another thing that people used to wipe on is uh, Scylla. Not not going to your platforms and getting petrified. I don't have Miasma. Oh, I do! I have Miasma too at this level. That's interesting. Yeah, you guys remember when we actually had to go to the platforms? When we, uh, we, when we had to kill all the snapper rooks in the ring, like, in the second boss. Fun times, right? <laughs> Nobody remembers that. I bet, I bet if you joined the game after in Heaven's Word, you're probably just thinking to yourself, What the hell is he talking about? There are just some things that get lost with the gear. I, I, I don't have anything to actually spend my stacks on other than Sacred Soil and Lustrate. Whoa, what was that? And we, we don't even take the time to get rid of our freaking lightning, I guess. Man, people aren't even stacked for... People are gonna die. Look at these people off in the ends. See these people? Those are dead people right there. Look at all these frozen people. That no one's going to break free. Oh look, I got, I got you, I got you, Diesel Klein. Also, I think you can totally just stand an ancient flare without having a puddle and be completely fine, like. Like the vast majority of the alliance right now, <laughs> like, just got, like come on, like there's no re there's no reason. Like you guys, you guys are very capable of walking over here, right? Oh my goodness, who didn't fill up their freaking thing yet? Okay, someone's already going there. This is exactly what I didn't want my alliance rate roulette to be. Just just the complete utter <laughs> just the complete utter skipping of mechanics and just face rolling all the bosses. That's that's what alliance rate has turned into. 
feels bad. Because Alliance Raids, when, when they're the most recent piece of content, tend to be one of my favorite pieces of content to do. I don't know. I don't know why. They just are. And, and, and when they're not the most recent piece of content, they turn into this and become probably the most irritating thing for me to do. I just got hit by Great Divide. Twice. No, never mind. I'm getting hit with Darkness. <laughs> Darknesses. Look, man. Look. Somebody... I don't know if it was the Bard of the Machinist, but somebody gave me Refresh. I totally left Aos behind, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I, I I forgot I placed her in the middle of the arena, <laughs> and then, then I just left her. Oh, I totally forgot about all the clones. Doga and Ume, right? Is there are there Ume clones? I don't remember. Une. Close enough. I, I don't remember what I was talking about earlier, but I remembered that, um... I remembered that I was, uh... I think it was in the main story that I was, um, talking about clones, and I couldn't remember their names. Lasia Labo Labolus Labolus Labolus. I t t frick, man. So, how's everybody's day going? I hope everyone's enjoying. Um, whatever, whatever you, it is you guys are doing. Holy crap! <laughs> My PC right now, I don't understand. My PC is out to get me. Just like, you know what, don't, don't show him the AoEs. Doesn't need to dodge them. Honestly, I, I probably don't. <laughs> I bet I could get hit with one or two of them and be just fine. Is everyone enjoying during Kingdom Hearts 3, Resident Evil 2? Those are probably two of the biggest titles that just, just released recently. Right, this is another thing. People don't don't do the uh, the clockwork clockwork rights. I mean, now we have enough DPS to just burn the boss, but before back back then we didn't, and um, it caused a lot of problems, namely uh, wiping. Wiping was the big problem that it caused. We never even get to do the snapper rook phase anymore. Feels bad. Also, I've got this was back in the day when uh, you only got one piece, one piece of gear per chest, which uh, sounds. I mean, it wasn't that bad, I guess, huh? Well, no. I mean, you didn't have to worry about ninja pieces for for the first one. But I think, I think ninjas used uh, striking back then. So yeah, you didn't have to worry about it until uh, World of Darkness.
<laughs> look, look at all the scholars, man. Or I guess summoners. Summoners don't have their upgraded miasmas and uh, in bios yet, so. There's a, there's a couple summoners in here. Right, what was the thing with Amon? People not putting down the ice blocks, like... Also, people not destroying the freaking the slimes before they get to him. I like how I like how all of my nostalgic memories that I'm reminiscing about are just memories of how much we just totally messed up <laughs> all the mechanics. It's like, yeah, you you remember that time we just wiped hopelessly on these bosses? Me too. Those were those are fun times. Oh, also another thing, the, the tank's not picking up the freaking kumkums. That's what another thing. Oh goodness, why? Why does my PC keep doing that? I don't understand. Well, I don't know if it's the PC or or my client. Or OBS messing it up, who knows. Oh no, I'm frozen. Let it go. Yeah, I don't think you can stand a curtain call. You might, if you're a tank, might be able to. But I'm pretty sure Curtain Call, Ancient Quagga, he, uh, should- No, no, he's freaking- You cannot stand in it. <laughs> good, good thing we, we established that. Why are we casting refresh pre-pull? I just don't understand. This was another thing. People just didn't want to stand in the yellow circles. I 
I don't think we had very many problems with uh, these, the meteors, the stonefall circles, and starfall circle. I guess unless people were dead. You know what we did have problems were, were though, was, was uh, Ancient Quagga and getting people to stack their freaking circles. That was apparently a big issue. Yep, you can't stand an Ancient Quagga either, even if you're a tank. Why? Oh, he lived! He had Rampart this time, I guess. <laughs> Oh, look at the two Machi Matter. I totally forgot that was a thing you could get. Look at all these things that I don't need. Shattered? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I forgot to get my commendation. Whoops. I was too busy not rolling on, like, a dozen pieces of loot. I totally spaced it. Sorry. I like to give those out when people deserve them. All right, I did grab it these times. Ah, man, that's really annoying. I hate. I hate going to the upper part of the Sea of Clouds when I don't need to. I guess I should give, uh, give the monastery a whirl. Oh boy, I can't wait. I totally forgot that healer cues are kind of messed up. Let's see. Hey, back you go as, as a bird. Ten minutes, it's not much better. <laughs> it's not much better at all. That reminds me, I need to update my um my ninja gear. It's been getting a uh, quite a bit of ninja gear lately. But I just haven't <laughs> I haven't been putting it on. Alright, so I have gloves and pants, so I'll just get rid of all this stuff. 40% is, is is a lie. It, it's, it's a lie. 
Forty percent. Ladies and gentlemen, forty percent. Forty percent. That's a twenty-five percent right there. See, I could use a belt, some legs, or I guess boots. I have legs. Yeah, lots to do. I wouldn't mind going on ninja, but my ninja isn't um isn't like prepared for it. So uh, maybe next week, I can probably pick up some more ninja stuff. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Let's see how far we can derail this train. Well, at least there's not like a gazillion bards. I feel like the last time I went on bard, there was like th three other bards. Oh yeah, I totally forgot, like, I made so much fish. I need to actually give some fish to Luana, because Luana's running out of fish. When I say running out, she still has like 60, 60 servings. Look at that, look at that. Ah, why? Stop doing this! <laughs> You know, it's, you know, it's probably because um, I, uh, I haven't actually rebooted my computer in a, a long time. I probably should. This is going swell. I always love seeing how, how much of a hard time tanks have picking up ads. Also, I know I don't have a song going, I just want to make sure I have Wanderers. I should have opened with Wanderers instead of Payon. I don't know why I opened with Payon. But, I mean, it's it's just trash anyway, so... Also, I'm I am actually glad that by now we've established that um the Viera have their own body types. Because I mean Fran was basically just an Elizin with bunny ears. That's that's basically what it was, but thinking back when when we saw Yugiri back in two point two, she was basically just a Mikyote with Yeah, a Mikyote with the little horns, but she was all covered up. <laughs> And then uh, Alrol got their own body types by the time they were revealed as the new race. Much more petite than uh, Mikyote.
Oh my goodness, Prox. Dirty dog, why are you tanking? Oh, cause the tank died. Yo man, you should uh, you should pop the version. You should uh, you should have popped Lucid too, actually. I don't I don't remember when he uh Yeah, right now. Well, rip my raging strikes. Also rip my wanderers, I just realized too. Honestly, whenever I play Bard, I'm just happy if I can get my freaking Refulgent Arrow <laughs> in my Raging Strikes window. That's that's all I really care about when I play Bard. Just, just, I just, I just want that. Just give me that, and I'm happy. Such, such is the nature of playing a job that requires so much RNG or relies on so much RNG. I personally don't mind it that much. I would I wouldn't mind if Bard was more consistent. Man, look at all those people who are gonna get hit. Okay, they actually moved. <laughs> Come on, Prox. Oh, Prox. Man, Prox. Man.
<laughs> what? Look at all the dead people because we didn't get heals from that. Oh man. That, that's, that is an embarrassing way to die. It's not even my fault. <laughs> How did that happen? How did that happen? Well, at least I got up in time to get my freaking... <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a good thing I, I have my refresh ready. I'm also gonna tactician. Christ. Come on, Prox. Don't let me down. Thank you. My healers let me down. Don't you let me down, too. Look at all those people who are about to die again. <laughs> oh man, there's a lot of dead people. What happened? I know it was just making fun of it, but dang. I really wish Bardis had blood bloodbath. Like, I guess you can't bathe in blood if you're shooting arrows from range, huh? I'm gonna... I'm gonna die. Yep. I just kind of accepted my fate after I, I st willingly stood in, in right hand gun. Okay, healers, come on, come on, healers, let's let's go. How's this gonna work? I guess we don't have to worry about it, I guess. Watch us just instantly die because we don't have the freaking marker. <laughs> just like... Okay, we're fine. You know, it says he's searching for a gap in your defenses, right? You'd figure that would mean that the big, like, shield thing around you is your defenses. But no, it's the opposite. I just, I don't even have words anymore. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. How how are we not getting heals? Is it because they're just casting nothing but cure three? That doesn't work unless everyone's stacked. I don't even want to accept this raise because I'm gonna have weakness or whatever. You never know, this might be the difference between um between us wiping and not wiping. Raise immunity, saves lives. Maybe I should have healed. I feel like I feel like Thanos right now. You know, you know, like at the end of of um, that's not, those are some nice, some nice gloves. I kind of want those gloves. I'll greet them. I feel like like you know at the end of of Age of Ultron. You're just like you know what? Fine, I'll do it myself. That's how I feel with healing. That's just that's just me. It's just I can I can always rely on myself to at least do a good enough job most of the time when healing. I'm not. I'm not saying I'm like I'm the best healer in the world, because I'm certainly not. But dang, at least at least I know I can rely on myself. Makes me wonder what what will happen if if 
we do get Dancer, and it, it ends up being a DPS and not a healer. Cause uh, I would suck. I, I wanna, I just wanna get, I wanna, I wanna play Dancer, man. Even if it isn't a healer. Oh look, I didn't win the gloves. Oh well. <laughs> he just left. All right, see you later, Samurai, my man. I don't, I don't even know if you were doing that well, but see you later. We got a new Samurai. Place the old Samurai. And we're not even gonna wait for the new Samurai. Let's screw it, man. Oh, please, thank you. Give me the procs. I didn't even didn't even focus target. Cutting it close with that iron jaws right there. Aww. I should really reboot my computer. All the stuttering is, is slowly getting to me. Look at these people trying to freaking slash the tainted souls with those. Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Seriously, we almost didn't kill it. Hey, we did it without getting like a gazillion stacks. I'm so proud. Oh, wow. What what a perfect thing to walk into. Come on, Prox, I believe. Thank you. You won't let me down, Prox. Oops. I did not mean to cast Troubadour there, but oh well. I know I'm B, but I'm just gonna grab the freaking thing just because I don't I don't trust I don't trust the other alliances that much. Uh, see? They're not they're not far enough away. We're gonna get hit with this. This is that's why I always take the shield, because I don't trust the, the other alliances to take the other ones away. Why am I taking? What? No. Mm -mm, we're not doing this right now.
<laughs> Wait, what? Why is our tank tanking C? I, you know what? Whatever. How did I miss? Oh, I know why, because I turned. Because I was, uh... Because I was still shooting my bow. <laughs> Well, why? So many interesting decisions being made in this alliance. I just, I can't wait to get to Thunder God, man. It's really just a toss-up if we actually get heals during AoE phases. I can't wait to see freaking Cleansing Strike. Well, I think we'll be fine with Cleansing Strike. I think one of our healers has a huge affinity for Cure 3. So Cleansing Strike shouldn't be that much of an issue if we're all stacked. Look at what, why would you stand there if you didn't need to? Why would you stand there if you didn't have the marker? And if you if you just wanted to stand there, why didn't you put up your shield? This is some run. I wouldn't mind that circlet on Luana. At this point, I'm just trying to gear my Dragoon on Luana. I think I'll take any ninja or tank piece on this character. Oh man, look at those branches. So good. I think they're branches, right? Yeah. Man, 
I'm kind of hungry. We've only been going for an hour and 12 minutes. Yeah. I'm hungry already. I just... I'm crying. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Oh, there we go. We made it. Look at that. The ones where, where he does the fours is, uh... Tends to be the one that trips up people, actually. Please, please heals. Please, please heals. Second win. Oh my goodness. <laughs> can't. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I, can't. I can't handle this right now. What? Why? Well, you, your heals aren't getting. Why are you using nothing but cure three? I can't. Real good. I can't. I cannot wait. Who the frick pulled already? <laughs> we, we are not ready for this. Why are you attacking me? Oh, I know why. Because our tank isn't here. We're gonna die. I'm gonna die at least. Please, now you can use Cure 3. Oh man. It'll be a miracle if we can make it through this. Oh, 
剣持つ定め地獄で悟れ恩の剣地獄の鬼首ある刃の空に舞う無限地獄の百万以上明快強強だ Here we go. Wow, why? Why did we use the take limit break? I, I, I don't know anymore, man. Kill this a little bit faster. Come on. Like, I thought we were actually going a little bit slow, but apparently we're the fastest one. Maybe we'll be fine. I don't know. I don't think we're gonna be fine. I think we need to, we need to pick up the pace a bit. Come on. Please. 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 No. Come on. No. I can't. I can't. I just. You can't see me right now, but I, I am surrendering. My hands are in the air. Man, Sid can't even just get it over with, man. He's just gotta freaking do freaking his balance break speech and just go freaking one million damage. I mean, as soon as we pulled like early, <laughs> I knew that this that this pull was just doomed. We actually waited for people. Kenno Goku, so 
の目で見るがいい闇の剣我に愛にし不幸を呪うがいい押しを振れ聖天爆撃だお手並み拝見の星の七つの影の計略を立つ北斗コサイド死ぬも生きるも剣持つ定め地獄で悟れ恩の剣And my cross haven't failed me once. That's nice. Actually, it might have happened once. You're dead. I'm sorry. <laughs> There's nothing I can do to save you. <laughs> I, I might have been able to cleanse the lightning, but uh, you took too much damage before then. I'm sorry. And me again for this. I just dropped my freaking dots like an idiot. Okay, we are... We are not exactly on track for killing these ads. I can tell you that much. What, what happened over here? That's what I want to know. We're not gonna kill these in time. <laughs> Look at this. This thing has 40% HP left. Man, the the other alliance didn't even kill their ad in time. Oh man. Ow, I just hit my knuckle on my desk. Alliance raids. Should really make a habit of doing these earlier in the week. All things considering, I don't think this is as bad as like Ozma. Ozma, people wiped so much on Ozma. Ozma was way more fun though. Also, Ozma had like really cool sound design. Ozma's sound design was so good. It felt so satisfying to play Ozma.
I was gonna check something and I totally forgot what. <laughs> well, that's what it was. Okay, what are we waiting for, exactly? Oh, that, there's some more people. Who's not ready? One of our healers isn't ready. Oh boy. <laughs> Somebody's pulling anyway, of course. Alright. I think someone else is gonna cast foes. I'll let them cast foes first. Oh, my procs. They have failed me. Well, at the very least, I'm getting a bunch of... bunch of Wanderer's Minuet stacks. Pitch perfect. I just realized I can cast my um, I can cast my Warden's Pain on the third stack because because it will get rid of the fourth stack or prevent the fourth stack from ever happening because of how Warden's Pain works. Hey! Nice to see that they didn't fail me this time. Decided to save foes for this. Might give us the extra edge we need. We're so gonna die. <laughs> Man, I can't even I can't even be upset anymore. It's just hilarious. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, this is what happens when people don't all decide to go to the same spot, I guess. 
Hey, look! My, my procs didn't fail me. What's really funny is that we had like three deaths, right? We're still kind of keeping track with the other parties in terms of DPS. didn't die this time. Or we got pretty damn close though. Although we might just wipe here. <laughs> wow. I just, I can't. What the hell? Can we get some heals, please? Please. These these white mages are a little too too attached to cure three, I feel. Look, look, there's another cure three. Procs, procs. Togismus. Skinado Karen. Nigos to them. Ah, I knew I was cutting it close with that iron jaws, but oh well. No, what? Last time I did this, like, none of the DPS wanted to, to take the crush armor marker. So it was basically just me and the tank, and uh, as you can imagine, both me and the tank died, so... That was great. Oh boy, here we go, here we go, here we go, yep, here we go. Oh my goodness, he made it, kind of. I don't know. We're, we're, we're gonna get hit with it. Ooh, it, it went away just in time. One of the groups is really struggling with their ad thing. Almost as much as my computer is struggling with my graphics. <laughs> but, but he still has 30% of his HP. Nigo 
And it makes me wonder if I'm not actually, if I wasn't actually here cleansing the crush debuff, if, if, if the tank would just die, because, dang. Yeah, figures. Figures! Make us run across the freaking room. He's usually about dead, I find, in most groups by now. Dead or we're dead? It's good to know that once we got past the fact that we had problems killing our ads, that we're actually okay with completing the rest of the mechanics. Even if it's just taking us much slower, our DPS just as, a, as an alliance must just be smaller. <laughs> That was almost really bad. <laughs> I'm not sure how, how much more damage not having a person in there would have done, but... Yeah. No thanks. Do I want that? Do I? This is a real good question. I don't know if I want that. I'll pass. I think I kind of just want to get the uh, the Genesis body for my ninja. We've almost been in here for an hour. <laughs> Look at these shadow qualities, man. Look at that. They're just like... <laughs> they're like just square pixels. I love it. And we're like floating above the ground, it looks like. No, we're, our feet are touching the ground. Final Fantasy XIV isn't actually that intensive. Like I could, I can actually run this on max settings if I want to. It's just um, doing so messes with OBS that uh, it's, I just I tend not to bother. bother. <laughs> if I'm not recording, I could. Oh, no, maybe I should have waited until the tank freaking actually hit. <laughs> actually got got in range. I hope I don't regret using that second win. 
Also, no procs. Feels bad. Oh, there's the procs. I totally forgot to um, cast refresh. Oh no, nope. Summon darkness. I actually, I think that's what she's saying, anyways. Hate the pillars so much. Okay, I should be fine right here. I have very big fears. So I'm not sure if we're gonna live through the the heal check. I really hope we do. Just like. You, you are permitted to spam as much Cure 3 as you want. As long as we live. So both the healers have already died once though, so the heals are going to be weakened by that. I didn't even know that she did this twice. Like usually we interrupt her doing this uh, as as she's doing Grand Cross, I feel. Also, one time I stood a little too close to the freaking to uh Earth Hammer and it freaking killed me. Like or hammer fall, that's what it is. Holy crap. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna. That's, there's no one's left alive. We're gonna die. Oh yeah, huh? Today is the Super Bowl. I totally don't watch the Super Bowl. <laughs> Uh, seven seconds on refresh. We are so gonna die. <laughs> we are so dead. Please. Uh, they, both our healers are on brink of death. That's like half. <laughs> that's like half the healing power taken away. That sucks.
Come on, you guys. You guys got a size, you got asylum, you got medica too. I believe. Even with Brink of Death, there should be there should be a cakewalk for a white mage. This is white mage's specialty. <laughs> I saw how low my HP got. I was in the it's in the thousands right there. We made it. Yes, we survived your ultimate the fire. That's very on the nose. Oh, that's that's all I was thinking when uh when when they announced Gunbreaker. It was like, damn, Gunbreaker. That is really on the nose for a name. Like, I was thinking, all right, Magitek Knight. Nope, Gunbreaker. I just totally dropped my freaking dots. Oh my gosh! <laughs> the one time I decided to actually do it, and <laughs> we still got freaking destroyed. I, I think it was just me and one other person who did it. <laughs> I just, okay. I mean, I figured, I figured people weren't gonna do it, but I didn't think that many people weren't gonna do it. Man. Why? Why would you do this? Why? Why did you do this? Why you... Look at all these poor people who are just coming into this. We're just all gonna die. Can we get some tanks to tank this, please? Someone, someone tank this, please. We can salvage this. Well, maybe, maybe not the, the tank doesn't get kills. Maybe not. <laughs> Also, I think in my procs, I'm very upset about that still. At least I didn't drop my freaking dots this time. Oh gosh, look, look at all these people who aren't doing this. <laughs> oh man, this, we still missed one. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Wow, those those kind of hurt when you have Vuln stacks. Don't typically hurt that much, but when you have Vuln stacks, they hurt. What? Oh, I pressed the wrong thing. It's on the wrong hotbar. Oh, see you later.
These healers really like Cure 3, man. I've never seen a healer use Cure 3 this much. Or if I have, it's usually because they think Cure 3 is a better version of Cure 2. <laughs> I don't think it's the case here. I almost dropped my dots because of that. Timing. Man, you guys already see that I'm here. Why are you here? <laughs> what the? Uh, I don't understand. Like, you see somebody is already here. Why don't you just go to a different one? Because last time I actually successfully did it, we, we still missed one. Alright. Where is the safe spot? It's like all the way back here. I'm actually kind of surprised I had enough time to run over here to make it. I just dropped my dust again. <laughs> I'm just... I'm paying a little too much attention to what everyone else is doing and not enough attention to what I'm doing right now. Look at this. I don't even have a song up. Look at this. I'm becoming one of the bards I was making fun of earlier. At the very least, like, she doesn't have very much HP. That was uh, probably the most painful run I've ever had of this. And that includes, like, day one runs. Skill speed tenacity. I bet, I bet the tanks really love this one. <laughs> wow. Should I, you know what? Oh no, 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 <laughs> no. Actually, look at this. I rolled a 97 on this, and I rolled a 1 and 2. I'll give it to the Dark Knight. The Dark Knight was a victim of circumstance. I would have won that armor too, huh? Look at that. Maybe I should have gotten it. Who knows? Save myself some time. Is this really worth waiting so that I can't get any of these? Holy crap, why are we still waiting? Uh... 
Uh, it's it's supposed to maybe supposed to maybe does that even make sense it might snow tomorrow in Portland Oregon could really use some soup I feel like soup maybe some like chowder like some corn chowder oh 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 man <laughs> That was, uh, something else. Oh boy. Alright, 250 out of 450. That's actually not that bad. Alright, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch over real quick. I think my um I think my tome situation is even worse on Luana. Oh man. Alright, hold on, I need to check on something. Put this over here. Did not think so. All right. Man, that is a long ass load time. I what? Maybe I really do need to reboot my PC. Holy crap. Well, I'm just going to do one more expert anyway. Because I am... I am starving. And it's very rude to eat. While recording. Not to mention that I actually have to go and cook it. So, that's... that's, that's oh, look. Look at this. This happens sometimes. I don't know. Sometimes my, my, my PC just decides it wants to have a hard time loading me into the game. There we go. We made it. Together we made it. Alright. How is my tome situation? This is it's so bad. Man, I'm gonna have to do so many experts. I'm trying to get used to Black Mage. Just because I wanna I wanna be able to play all all the casters if I uh, end up switching and focusing on casters going into um going forward I guess but you know preparing for that kind of thing just sometimes doesn't even matter because the jobs change so drastically in between expansions sometimes sometimes it's it's very minor like between like like with monk it's been fairly minor changes I would say like monk monk still feels the same as it did in Rome Reborn. you just got more stuff to press and then sometimes it, and sometimes there's a freaking bard where you go from you go from, you know, not having very much to do, to, to freaking being a bow mage, to being an RNG freaking arrow master, <laughs> or 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 machinist. That that changes drastically. What else changed drastically? I feel like most of the jobs changed a lot from a Roman born to Heavensward, and then going into Stormblood, some of the jobs got simplified, which um, ended up meaning that they kind of just lost a bit of what they were in heaven's word i don't know i don't even know what i'm saying anymore the hunger it's it's rotting my mind that or whatever experience we just had in the monastery is rotting my mind that reminds me singing buckaboo that i need to probably need to grab my weekly stuff Also, 18 minutes for expert. Fun.
I did not mean to cast that, but okay. Oh man, I'm gonna have to grind for so many tomes. It's gonna be so good. It's actually not that bad, honestly, if I think about it. Oh, you know what else I need to do is, um... I need to, uh... Do my... My V4s. Or I guess it would be, um... 012 or whatever. Yeah, that. Because those are still capped, the uh, the crystal loids or whatever they use for the weapons. I imagine they will uncap it eventually, but it never hurts to stock up on those. Plus, I don't mind doing those. Oh, 11 is still my favorite. All right, what are we looking at? House. Shearing stones. We could probably go to Tanamizu as well. And Dawn Throne. Alright. Oh, so while we're waiting, we can go ahead and uh, talk about some of the more recent news. So I put up that video uh, talking about like the extended trailer and all that. There's just been a couple people who have uh, rebutted against my theory about Matoya being in Yeshtola's body, which, that, to be fair, that is a pretty out there theory, but that was just the first thing that popped into my mind, so I was like, you know what, I'll, I'll share it. So what? I can I can see I can see that kind of happening honestly like honestly th all right there's a couple there's a couple things that I've been thinking about first off that crazy theory could be right which if it is then honestly I completely surrender myself that that would that would be really out there I think. I think now that I think about it more, and uh, as some people have suggested, it's probably just the fact that Matoya did something that um, maybe maybe she died or something, and uh, Yeshtola has decided to take up her name, which is a real shame because Yeshtola's name is so pretty. I, I love Yeshtola's name. Um, so that, that's that's probably more that's probably the uh, the more likely theory. My theory is just kind of like really out there, like like I theorized Yeshtola didn't get put back into her body when she was called and Matoya somehow got put into, put herself in Yeshtola's body for whatever reason. Don't know why she would end up doing that. But uh, th that was my theory that I came up with at 3 o'clock in the morning, so um, yeah, I'm, I'm just, I'm gonna stick by my guns and if that happens to come true then uh, Wow, I will I will be genuinely surprised. Uh, another theory is that this is all happening like on a different different star, a different shard, and uh, the characteristics of the, of the characters have changed a bit. I don't know. See, that theory is also very out there. But I was thinking about that as well. Is that what if what if this is all just a different star? What if what if at the end of Stormblood? the warrior of light gets called as well and and then because he's been called to some other other sh other shard other star i don't remember which one is the per the proper terminology for distinguishing which but what if where he's at the warrior of light highland's blessing doesn't work so that's why he has to channel the darkness within and then everyone everyone else like has different characteristics based on that i don't know that, that is another way out there theory that I just came up with two minutes ago. <laughs> so.
So, so there's that. Um, what else? Oh yeah, we had the um, the announcement for the Final Fantasy 15 collaboration, which freaking finally! I've been waiting for that for so long. I know a lot of people don't like Final Fantasy 15, but I actually really enjoyed Final Fantasy 15. It's like I, I I can acknowledge it's not a very good game, but damn, do I like Final Fantasy 15. Like the story might not be told in the best way possible, but uh, I don't know. I still enjoy it. There's just something about it that I just enjoy still, despite the fact that it it is an extremely flawed game. But uh, finally, we get the freaking collaboration event, and it looks like it's like a combination of doing stuff in the open world, ending with a trial with with like a. Uh, another version of a Garuda fight which seems interesting get the get the regalia as a car mount I'm really hoping we get some um, Final Fantasy 15 weapons uh, as glamour for for us that'd be really cool I think also I'm really hoping we get some Final Fantasy 15 music as our Kestrian rolls because that would be awesome Apocalyptus Noctis is uh, one of my favorite themes in video game history, I would say. I don't know, I just... That that theme is... It gets me pumped every time. Without fail. So... Oh, looks... <laughs> looks like uh, somebody else was trying to kill that. Sorry! I mean, I, I kind of hit it first, I think. I don't, I don't know. I'm really curious to see what they're gonna do with Shadowbringer because it's their chance to do something um, kind of out there with Shadowbringers, right? Because I mean, going into Heaven's Word, we we kind of knew what was happening, you know. Like we got stripped out of everything, you know. We were we were a fugitive on the run. We we were <laughs> framed for the assassination of Nanamo. All of our allies in the uh, in the Scions were were you know pretty much wiped out for all we knew they were dead so we just kind of had to work with with our connections given to us by Harshafon and and basically get pulled into Ishgard's problems as we kind of sort things out and it ended up being quite a quite a decent war and political story which I rather enjoyed and uh, I don't know I really liked Heaven's Word's story it was a it was a good war story. It was good, it was a good political story, and we had major ramifications for it. People died, you know. We we lost the sale, you know. People people died during that, which is uh, we lost Harshafon. You know, those are probably two of the biggest deaths we've had in in the series. And Stormblood didn't really live up to that, like at all. It's come it's come to the point. Where unless you actually see somebody physically die in front of you, you just presume that they lived. Okay, freaking Gaius, Gaius lived. Um, freaking who else lived? Gosetsu lived. Yatsuyu lived. It's just like, it's like death is no longer a a um something to worry about it feels like because it just it always feels like they just they just come back anyway which is really unfortunate that's death should be a major stake in in these stories but it just it doesn't feel like it anymore the weight of death has kind of been pushed away you know Nanmo survived all the scions survives it's like you can only you can only do the same trick over and over again before before it gets old so uh, going into Stormblood, it was it was another war story. You know, we just got done with one war, and we're going into another war. So it was another war story. First off, it was also a liberation story, and that's just, that's just it doesn't lend itself to a very somber tone, like uh, like Heaven's Word did. You know, there was a lot of feelings of kind of hopelessness, hopelessness, and 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 themes of things just being bigger bigger than us individually. I mean, the dragons are a very imposing force, and and the, the lives of the more mortal races are kind of just like a blink blink in the eye for the dragons. The dragons have, are ancient, they've been around forever, so it just feels like we're, you were going against this ancient ancient force that, that seems very immovable, you know? 
and, and that really helps to, uh, to to create a more somber and sort of hopeless tone throughout the already you know undertones of war and politics and all of that that was going on in, in heaven's word but when we got to stormblood it was like oh yeah liberation you know empowerment and it was like didn't quite have the same weight i felt like so now i'm just rambling on i feel but i don't know there's just something about stormblood that just didn't didn't resonate as well with me so it, it's now time like we're we're, st we're still in the middle of a war you know let's not kid ourselves we're still in the middle of a war but it, it's a chance for for them to do something different with uh with shadowbringer so i'm very very excited to see what they do with the story i know i know for a lot of people uh with final fantasy 14 the story just isn't their thing like they just skip the cutscenes and, and whatever that's that's their choice there's definitely a lot of more reading, and a, there's there's a lot of politics. Like literally, Final Fantasy XIV is just the game about politics. There's so much politics woven into the story because there's so many factions, all trying to accomplish their own things. And even even though there's a lot of factions that are allied together, every every faction has their own needs and wants and their own problems to deal with. So it's it's kind of a given that uh, politics would pay a very big factor within Final Fantasy's 14 story. Uh, it's 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 a far it's a far cry from where we started off with with just killing primals. That was, that was literally that was literally all the story was basically at, at the very at the very start. It seemed like it was just to go kill primals. Primals bad. Go kill them. Oh, you know what I need to do as well is my domain reconstruction thing. That was another thing too that I forgot to talk about is that supposedly there's a uh, high-end content for crafters and gatherers with um, with reconstructing the Holy Sea of Ishgard, which sounds interesting. I, I would like to participate if possible, but um, I don't know. Keeping up with uh, with crafting and gathering just hasn't been something I've been uh, very active about. Like, I actually did buy gear to meld for my crafters, but I just never melted them. <laughs> because I, I kept looking at the material prices for crafting, and I was just like... No, no thanks. I'll pass. Oh, also another thing I, I forgot to mention was the new game plus feature, which sounds really interesting. I really, it'd be nice if uh, if you could replay side quests with that too. But uh, I don't, I don't think people, I don't think there's even that many people who want to replay old main story moments, and uh, and of those people, I highly doubt many of them would uh, would um, request that it also work on side content as well. But uh, it's supposedly a feature that'll uh, let you uh, re replay some of the main scenario, um, I guess, duty instances. So like, so things like, like the Nadam and and, and all that, and uh, and that uh, like alliance bout. I forgot what they called it, where we sided with Ishgard for some reason, like. <laughs> We sided with Ishgard for some reason. That thing. Do you guys even remember that? I think that was right. Was it right before Stormblood? I don't remember. It's been so long, honestly. I think it was. It was in. Um, I think it was in 3.4 when it happened, because it was. It was following the events of. Uh, of having beaten Nidhogg. I'm, I'm pretty sure. For some reason, I have memories of having done it fairly recently, but that, that doesn't sound right. Because <laughs> uh, the only the only characters that I have that are 
in Stormblood are Luana and um, and my main, so that that doesn't sound right. And S S hasn't even made it to Heaven's Word yet. I think she's in 2.3, which is there's a lot of filler in 2.3. Man, this expert is taking forever, and I need to do a lot of these. Maybe the queue times will uh, will will speed up um, tomorrow. Maybe there's actually a lot of people watching the Super Bowl or something. I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't watch sports. Oh, hey, we got this one again. Bum 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 da 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 Just let me get my Blizzard 4 off. I'm just gonna fire four of these guys. How the hell did I let my freaking <laughs> Nokian fall off? I, I know how I did it, but how? How did I do that? How did I manage that? I mean, I didn't have any Blizzard or Ember Hearts anyway, so it didn't really matter that much, but still. I'm out of freaking MP. <laughs> I forgot that um, because my I wasn't doing my normal rotation that I wouldn't have um, as much MP as I normally would have. Man, come on. <laughs> come on! Come on, man! You did that on purpose. Oh wow, I moved too early. God dang it. That's my bad.
bum 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 na 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 This is probably gonna be our last rendition of the Stormblood theme, guys. Like, they've only remade this theme like, like, like a lot, actually. <laughs> I mean, I don't mind it. I like the Stormblood theme, but I have to acknowledge they, they have remade this theme a lot. Like, a lot. I don't even know what to target. I don't know why Lisa's voice is so, so loud. Also, I feel like Lise, or Lise, is, is the one character who's, whose name pronunciation I keep going back and forth on. Yo, you calm down. <laughs> you got time. Plus, I have my own teleport. Thank you very much. Actually, I should probably do this because he's gonna. Yeah. I'm already in the safe spot. Hey, look at that. I'm a magician, a black magician, dark magician.
Man, we just melted that pack. Man, look at look at uh, look at Eric, man. He's a freaking melee, and he he ran out of range just so he wouldn't hit anybody. What a trooper! These double hands just have it out for me, man. It's just like, you see that black mage over there? I'm gonna make him move. I'm thunder through this thing. Thought I got the first flare off, just barely didn't. Come on, man! Just like, can we stop dropping AOE's on the Black Mage? That's that's so mean. I know you guys are doing it on purpose. I just, <laughs> I totally, totally just dropped a Nokia twice in a row. I mean, it, it, it doesn't matter that much, but still. Come on, Suki. Seriously! I blame all the, the just, I swear, every single AoE has been targeted at me. I feel violated. Want to stand still? Be lazy. Oh, it's he in again. I should have I should have prepped some umbral hearts honestly while I was waiting. Oh well. I never said it was a good black mage. Ah, <laughs> uh, that that lawless scream when he fell. That amuses me more than it probably should. One of them is pointing right at me, isn't it? Oh, he almost died.
think the most annoying part about this fight is how arrogant both of them are and how long it takes for them to actually do their do their moves. It's just like, come on. Nobody has time for this. Oh, that is, uh, I'm dead. <laughs> I was not expecting a bomb to be right in the middle. Why was there a bomb right in the middle? <laughs> I was like, you know what? I got this. I'm just fine. Then there was a bomb in the middle. And I was like, oh, never mind. I don't got this. I kind of miss having mana wall. Remember the old mana wall? That was so good. You could use that to like cheat like demon wall. It was so funny. You could you could stand in uh and wait to the land with those. I think right. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of miss when mana ward and mana wall were thrown separate things. Back in the day. No, I wonder if we can like precast your uh, limit breaks. That'd be great. No, I don't want to freaking do that. I want to foul. How did I end up casting Blizzard 3? Oh well, does not matter. Huh? Where, where's my goodbye? There's there's my goodbye. I don't even have my, my emotes working right now. <laughs> I turned off my emotes. Oh, man. I am... It's actually 6 o'clock. This is like the ideal time for eating dinner, right? I'm still fairly behind on tomes, but uh, I can work on that later tonight and tomorrow, I guess. Tomorrow's expert will put me at 290. And uh, another. If I do 012, that'll put me at 300, which means I'll only need to do three experts. Or. Or two experts and an alliance raid. Or something to that effect. Or I could just do a bunch of, like, Ritoranas and Royal Cities and stock up on coins, because I'm actually running low on coins on this character in particular. Yeah, all I have are. Two, two of the coins from Red Arana. So, maybe I should do some of those. But I'm gonna go eat dinner. Cook dinner first, unfortunately. Then I can eat it. So, I'll catch you guys later. Hopefully, you enjoyed my suffering with me. Oh boy. Anyways, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Whatever video that might end up being. Maybe I'll record a bit tomorrow as well. So, look forward to something in the near future. Yeah, I'm so good at these outros, by the way. Sayonara, bye-bye.